Hi, my name is Holly Hireman, CEO of Fit Finances and Online Health and Wellness Coach. Today I'd like to talk to you about the importance of sleep and how getting enough sleep can greatly affect your weight loss results. Now I've heard this said for many years that it's really important to get enough sleep, especially when you're starting a new fitness program. You gotta make sure you get enough sleep. And I, I don't know about you, but sometimes that seems like an impossible task. So I've done a little bit of research and um, just with some very, very simple science, I hope by the end of this video, you'll be convinced as well that you need to get those Z's. It is so incredibly important. So let's talk about this. Your body has two different hormones that it produces, one that stimulates hunger and one that tells you that you're satisfied. So the one that stimulates hunger is called ghrelin. And that is the hormone that basically tells your brain that you need to eat. And the hormone leptin is the one that tells your brain that you've had enough, that you're satisfied. Now the very interesting thing that happens in accordance with um, the science behind sleep is that when you get too little sleep, what ends up happening is your body naturally creates or increases that hormone um, of ghrelin, telling your body that you need to eat more, and it naturally decreases the amount of leptin in your body. So really, it's a hormonal thing. If you're not getting enough sleep, you will definitely have more ghrelin, therefore, you'll have more of an appetite, and you're definitely going to have less leptin, which is the one that's, that tells you you're, you've had enough. In fact, this is so critical that studies show that people who get five hours or less of sleep on an average per night are 50% more likely to be obese. So 50% more likely to be obese if you're functioning on five hours or less every night. That statistic just blew my mind and absolutely made me a believer. I used to be one of those people that could function on, you know, definitely function on four hours of sleep on a regular basis. Every now and again, I might get seven if I was lucky, but it's become something that's been a regular part of my life. And after doing this research, I am so glad that I did make it a regular part of my life is getting enough sleep each and every night. So what is enough sleep? Well, studies show that the people who get seven to nine hours of sleep on average every night, and you might be one that needs a little bit less or you might be one that needs a little bit more, but the people who get seven to nine hours of sleep each and every night actually are healthier individuals and their hormones in those two areas are way more balanced. Now, if that is not enough to convince you, then let me tell you this last little piece is when you're tired, and you can probably relate to this when you're tired, you, you naturally want to, you crave things, you eat more. And this is because of those two hormones that are in your body. So think about those times when you're really tired and what do you normally grab for? You grab for the sugary things, you grab for treats that are, you know, really unhealthy for you. You're less likely to make really wise decisions when you are feeling run down and rugged. So that's my tip for you. I hope that you have an amazing day. If you have any questions, please feel free. You can comment below or send me an email and have a great day. Happy sleeping.